So, I'm Phil Lama and this is World Box. And this is the Polar Universe. I mean, it looks pretty accurate in my opinion. I mean, it looks pretty good. I think from what I read um, on whoever made this map, it has all the fallouts included. So all the, um, all the little references. Um, let me see if it includes the cities. Let me see. Village layer. Oh, it does. So the capital wastelands. So this is for work uh, for Fallout 3. Commonwealth. Oh, this is awesome. Vote zero. I don't remember this. Is this from uh, an old game? Maybe. Uh, Junction City. Yeah, this must be from a really old game from Fallout 1 or 2. I'm not sure. No, but Fallout 1 and 2 are from are, are from here, should you say. I didn't actually play Fallout 1 or 2. Well, I tried to. I was just a little boy when um, I would try to try them and I failed miserably. <laughs> I should actually give them a try, actually. Oh, shit. So yeah, Shady Sands, and if you've watched the the series, this is not no longer here. But yeah, this is pretty cool. I wasn't expecting this to be so accurate. It doesn't have everything, of course. It doesn't have all the vault locations, but it's still interesting. And the the biome is the um, the biome after the um, the bombs. Uh, if you see here, there will be some little slimes popping out sometimes. So it's pretty cool. Oh, the Great Legion. New Vegas was awesome. Uh, <laughs> it was. But I, I still think Fallout 3 is my favorite. I've spent so long playing for, uh, Fallout 3. It was crazy. That and Skyrim. Those two s occupied so long of my childhood. It was crazy. Caesar's Legion. So, oh yeah, it does have Caesar. So is this, is this Mr. House? Yeah, it is. Okay, this is good. I like it. NCR... Aaron Kingball, that's correct as well. The She, I don't know what this is, actually. King She Emperor, I don't know what this is. No clue. White Legs, I don't remember this either, to be honest. Maybe from Vegas, from New Vegas, maybe? I'm not sure who I'm gonna root for. Oh, we have, we have war. So, Eastern Brotherhood of Steel versus the Pit Raiders. I might root for them, to be honest. Because this is where Sarah Lyons is, right? Yeah, Elder Arthur Maxon. So, I think this is the, the father of uh, Sarah Lyons. And Sarah Lyons is awesome. Come on. So, I think I'm gonna root for these ones. And I, correct me if I'm wrong, because it's been a long time since I've played Fallout 3. This section of the Brotherhood is not that crazy compared to the other ones. Because the other ones are fucking mental. They, they just... They, they're religious zealots, right? As far as I remember, these ones are... Okay. I could be wrong. Correct me, please, because uh, it's been a long time. M most of the time I played Fallout, it was with mods. Like, lots and lots and lots of mods. I spent way too much looking for mods as well. So there's an another war here. So the Great Khans versus the new Kanan. Uh, so Caesar's Legion declared war on the on New Vegas. Oh, so the, the game is happening. <laughs> the battle for Hoover Dam, no? So I think New Vegas will have no chance. Like, at all. Like, Caesar's Legion is massive. Are they fighting just Vegas? I think so. Yeah, I think so. Ooh, NCR declare war on who? Okay, New Vegas is gone. So I guess Caesar won the war. Uh, ooh, the, the Brotherhood on the East is getting massive. They're still fighting the Pit Raiders. It's a shame that we don't have the, um, the Enclave here. Do we? Am I wrong? I'm not sure what the Enclave is, actually. Okay, New Canaan destroyed um, the, the Great Khans. The Pit Raiders are pretty much done for. I wonder where the little slimes are. I haven't seen one, actually. But they, they should spawn. What's this little penguin here? Look at him. So cute. A thousand years old. Okay, the Shi declare war on the Pit Raiders as well. But there's only six. Well, I suppose they are also here, and they may... They may want to conquer this as well. Makes sense, I suppose. Okay, the pit raiders are gone. Okay, so far, the Great Legion is the strongest one. White Legs is being conquered by I don't know who. Who's this? Oh, the Commonwealth. What the fuck? Why are they so far away? <laughs> Why are they so far? Why are they in Canada? Okay, I guess the Commonwealth is huge now. <laughs> Okay, Chicago Brotherhood declared war on the Xi. Are these the Chinese? 
It would make sense, but uh, is there a state of China in in California in Fallout? I, I, again, no clue, but I'm gonna investigate that because it sounds interesting. I really need to play the first games, to be honest. In fact, I also want to play Fallout 4 and 3, but in a completely different way. Like, for example, Fallout 4 without killing anyone. Can you imagine that? It would be fun, no? Oh. Boring Super Mutants declared war on Nuka World Raiders. Uh, and the mid the Midwest Brotherhood declared war on the mu Super Mutants as well. Wait, are the Super Mutants orcs? Oh, they are. <laughs> yeah, that, that makes sense. Yeah, actually, it makes perfect sense. But yeah, they're, they're pretty much gone. They, they had no chance. But yeah, j just being friendly, just being... If, if Just look at the series and think the main character. Like, she's just... Really nice, and I want to be to be really nice throughout the whole throughout the whole playthrough. It will be funny, I think. So the super mutants are gone. The Eastern Brotherhood of Steel is massive, but still. Oh, Caesar is gone. The NCR just destroyed the um, the Caesar's Legion. What the fuck? Didn't even notice. So the NCR is currently the strongest one, and they are over here as well. Everything is happening at the same time and so fast. I kind of want the Eastern Brotherhood to win. Now that I think of it, yeah, I do want them to win. I also really, I also really like Mr. House. Like, it's a really cool character. Not cool in the good way, <laughs> just cool in the villain, in the villain type of way. I like him. Okay, the NCR is basically fighting everyone. I, I wonder. I think they will win. I think they will win. Uh, I don't want them to. I actually like the NCR. They're, they're, they're pretty much, uh, like the. the they're the good guys, really. Like, I suppose they are pretty much the good guys. But I don't want them to win. They're too much of a good guys, I think. Far Harbor declared war on Commonwealth. The Eastern Bloc has 450,000 already. The Commonwealth is gone from the Commonwealth. <laughs> so, yeah. Far Harbor is from the expansion, no? And Point Lookout as well. I'm pretty sure. I didn't play those expansions, I didn't have money for that. But I should! I mean, it's... it's oh, the Eastern... Eastern Brotherhood is massive. So the Commonwealth is gone. The Eastern Brotherhood is now 500. But the NCR is 890. Chicago Brotherhood is fighting the Midwest Brotherhood. And I think they're gonna lose for sure. It's so confusing the fact that all of them have the same colors. So at the moment we only have... NCR, New Canaan, the Midwest Brotherhood of Steel, the Chicago Brotherhood, um, Eastern Brotherhood of Steel, Point Lookout, and Far Harbor. Okay, so NCR declared war on Chicago, and that is gonna be their doom. Yeah, no chance. 145 people, they're being fought on two fronts, so Chicago is pretty much gone. Yeah, they're being conquered. NCR took almost all of it, and now only a little bit is left. But I think they're they're pretty much over. Ooh, the Eastern Brotherhood declared war on Point Lookout, and really, really easy. Like, no chance. They should get Far Harbor as well, but still, it's such so small, it's not going to impact anything. They need to fight Midwest, otherwise they will... They will just lose, I think. Because NCR pretty much has whole America, the whole of America and Canada as well. They also have Quebec over here. Uh, the Eastern Brotherhood of Steel has almost everything in the north of Canada. Okay, Chicago Brotherhood, one person, and they're gone. Oh, it's this guy, the warrior. Eastern Brotherhood of Steel actually got Mexico and the, the rest of the countries below them. I don't remember all of them, like Nicaragua, etc, etc. So maybe that will give them population, but still, not great. But still, I, actually, I, I am wrong. 1,100 versus 1,300. They actually have 500 army versus 670. It's not that bad. So if they take the Midwest, they will be actually linked, finally. Even though this part over here is kind of, like, separate. Could be its own country, to be honest. But still, these guys in the Midwest are kind of fucking things up. Okay, Eastern Brotherhood declared war on Far Arbor, so they're pretty much gone as well. Yeah, really easy. 
Oh no, the NCR declared war on the Midwest. That's not good. If they take it, the Eastern Brotherhood is gone. Like, they have no chance. Because, like, this is the part that they needed. Yeah, they're just getting fucked. Like, no chance. 160 people. Yeah, they have so many soldiers. Look at this. A massive army. They can just come in and take it. See? So this means that the Eastern Brotherhood is... Well, they will have not much of a chance, to be honest. Although the populations are getting very, very close. Uh, but still, unless these guys actually take Alaska and spread everywhere and the rest of Mexico, I don't see how they could win. Because they, the NCR has more land to, to have babies in. Okay, the war started. 1,900 versus 1,800. So it's actually very close. I really hope the Eastern Bloc wins. Although, again, these are my two favorite factions. <laughs> I, I like both. I do want the Eastern Bloc to win, though. Okay, there's a big battle here in the middle. Who's this guy? Shi Emperor. I still don't know who it is. <laughs> Another big battle here. There's just arrows everywhere. Okay, 1,900. Oh, 1,700. So the Eastern Bloc is actually winning at the moment. 1,600. 1,800. I think the NCR is screwed. The NCR is actually focusing their efforts on the north for some reason, so they want... Well, actually, it makes sense. If they cut off this part, if they conquer this part, it, they will have way more population. Like, no chance, but still, if they don't defend the southern bits... Oh shit, they are actually losing now. I think the Eastern Brotherhood is gonna lose. I think the NCR is gonna be the new America. Yeah, I think they will win. They're basically conquering the, the north of Canada. And the south of Canada as well, look. Oh, they took Florida. Oh, this is not good. So the Eastern Bloc is gonna lose for sure now. 800 people. They're actually fighting Elder Arthur. He's alone. He's gonna die, no? Oh, he's in the middle of the NCR. He's gonna die. That's sad. 700 people. Yeah, they're pretty much over, I think. Unless nukes show up. Or the, the aliens. Is this Megaton? Yeah, this is Megaton. Do you see this? Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> I think I think it is. But yeah, 400 people. NCR pretty much took everything. We only have a little bit of, the, of Alaska, but it's almost gone. So yeah, I think, I think this pretty much confirms it. NCR is the new America and Canada and Mexico as well. Uh, so NCR took over the whole of the of the northern part of the continent. So yeah. Thank you very much, I hope you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you soon.